Well, it's a rainy day here at ITB, but we're staying high and dry here in this mobile health clinic. So with this mobile health clinic, the customers will be rolling up into those uh, neighborhoods where people are going to be underserved. The low income, those dealing with mental health issues, addictions, those types of things that have barriers to getting into mental health, this is going to get them in their foot in the door and get them the services and help that they need. So what we start off with here is the brains of the operation. So we've got your control panel up here that's got your automatic leveling leg, so single push button, activation, and the whole unit is stable and level. We've got your automatic gen start, so that'll fire up on low battery voltage or anytime you need to get that power. So down below, what you can notice here is we have a nice big pass-through. So you can close it to get yourself that privacy you might want, or else you leave that door open and you can pass directly easily from the cab right into the body. So no need for the practitioners to get out on a cold rainy day like this. They can just move right into the clinic and uh, stay nice and warm while they're doing it. So what we have here is a rated seat for travel. And so that's gonna allow them to take along a third person so that they have all the staff that they need on site without having to take an extra vehicle with them. So when you come aboard the clinic, first of all, what you can experience is a security system that's gonna allow them to make sure that the uh, staff and clients are safe and secure. So there's an intercom system for access, as well as a key card system for staff to be able to get in and out securely. Of course, if you're doing a mobile health clinic, especially to underserved populations, you really need to have that accessibility. You don't want to have any barriers to that healthcare that they need. And so we have installed a wheelchair lift here right on board. So they're going to be able to bring any individual, even those with mobility challenges, up and onto the unit and let them access those services. So coming down here, you've got a nice work surface for uh, the staff to be able to do their clinical preparations, whatever it is that they need to do. Lots of storage up here. We've got your motion sensor sink for that, for the uh, hygienic side of things. One of the amazing things about this unit, again, talking about that accessibility, is we do have a bathroom that is fully accessible for individuals who have mobility challenges. Now we're in the room where the client is gonna actually receive the medical care that they need. So here they're gonna meet up with the practitioner who's gonna give them their medical examination, discuss what health problems they might be facing, and just give them that checkup that they need to make sure that they're healthy. We've got uh, fridges in here, which are gonna handle vaccine storage or sample storage. But we've got a lot of purpose-built items in this vehicle. It's built exactly the way the customer needs it, but it really represents just one way that you can do mobile health in your community. And there's so many different options we can do to help bring that healthcare to the people who need it most.